Hello again, Dead Rising 2. So basically, this guy on a motorcycle just challenged me and gave me this motorcycle. But it's not really fair because his motorcycle has chainsaws in it. And mine's just a regular motorcycle. Let's go. And at this point in the game, I didn't know there was a chainsaw up there, so. That. Oh, that was cool. Look at that. I should get points for that. Alright, I hope you guys are sprinting behind me, because I'm not backing up for you damn hillbillies that keep shooting me. Kill all the zombies with my bag. Oh. Uh, you can download that song on iTunes. Yeah. No, I'm kidding. All right. Oh my God. Dude with the motorcycle. Stop fucking up my host. I mean my 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 hostages. What are they called? My escorts. <laughs> oh fuck. That hurt. Yeah, yeah. Take that. Now you're stuck against the. Yeah. How did your chainsaw go down? Oh, get in the corner, bitch. Stay there. Yeah, just keep... Oh my god, he's stuck in the corner. This is awesome. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Who's a bitch now? I don't even need a motorcycle. Oh, get off me, man. Can't you see I got bigger problems? Come on, bitch. Oh, you can't handle this. I'm the MMA fighter of the century. Taking zombies and a motorcycle maniac. Yeah, oh god, he, I think he got out of the corner. Oh no. I don't know what this exactly means, but it's nighttime now. Which means it's nighttime now. Alright, hillbillies, let's go. Why is this guy always pushing that wheelchair? Is he just like happy he can walk now? Maybe it was his wheelchair? All right. Oh, you're gonna trash the place? Not with me on watch, you fucking emo looters. All right, I just need some supplies. And uh, I need a flashlight and some jewels. And anyone who's played this before knows what I'm making. But I don't want to ruin the surprise, so I'm not gonna tell you that's a chair. You need the flashlight. There you go. Get some jewels. Whoa, I like her. She doesn't exactly shoot me. Alright, now I got everything I need. Let's go cut some bitches up with my Wolverine gloves. And poop like that. Follow the arrow. Just follow the arrow. Oh, that one didn't sound happy. Keep going. You're almost there. Oh, just get them to safety. I'll be honest, I, I did this part like three times, and I just want to get these hillbillies to safety, because they kept shooting me to death. Yeah, that, that would have been your fucking head. Yeah, you just shot your own daughter, are you stupid? Yep, you got shot in the back, and you're like, Hallelujah! I just spit something out. Had a little phlegm in my throat. <laughs> I know you all wanted to know that. Alright, let's keep going. And we're at the safe house. I'm going to show you guys my crib. What are you shooting at? Just come in here. Oh, damn walls and edges always getting in my way. Uh, flashlight. What's urgent? What's urgent is me making a flashlight and blending it with jewels to make an awesome lightsaber. Mm, yeah, I should cut you guys in fucking half just to show how effective it is. Uh, 
All right. I guess I'll just save you. What's up? Yeah, what's up? Stop trying to sound cool. Alright, crawl through this vent and you'll be safe. Yay! Alright, I'm gonna end this one right here. Because you stupid hillbillies are safe. Now go do stupid things together with your stupid selves. See you guys next time. Ooh, I got so much stuff. So overwhelming. Yeah. So I was thinking about reality TV the other day and how I don't watch it anymore. And then I started thinking about how we could make reality TV better. And I think I came up with a solution. If we want to make reality TV better, we just have to add cocaine. Now I don't want you thinking that I'm some big cocaine activist. Because I've never even tried cocaine and I don't think anyone else should try cocaine. Unless they're on reality TV.